What is going on guys? It's been a little while. The last video I just talked a lot. So we're gonna go get some stuff done today. It's about 10 a.m. right now. I have not ate anything. I've only been up for an hour to be honest. I got some good rest and sleep um, today. So what we're gonna do right now is head out to the garage. I have a couple projects I want to get done today and then uh, get a workout in later today. So first off, um, we had a new garage door a couple months ago. Um, the last one was bowing in and you had to like push it up in order to get it to close down. So 1600 bucks, got a brand new garage door and the very next day, the opener quit working. So now I'm the opener. So what I'm going to try and do today is get that working. And then um, I got a new little thing to put on my truck. Um, that's a, I had one on my last truck, but I haven't had one on this one yet. So I got a new bull bar to put on the new truck. So I'm going to try and get both of these done today. That way tomorrow... Um, I can get the yard mowed and stuff, so which it needs that quite bad. So looks like I need to move the side by side out. Um, that way I have room to work. Um, I'm gonna get the old opener off. I got the new one all taken out and put on the table over there. So I'm just going to set you up on a tripod and do a little time lapse of me not knowing what I'm doing. And I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to close the garage door. So we'll do that first. So I got the old opener removed 
and um, I'm gonna finish my double tap real quick before I get started on the new one because I have no idea what I'm doing so I'm gonna have to read the directions for a while uh, obviously the taking down the old one didn't take very long um, and my only concern is the old opener wasn't long enough for the door we have and we, so we bought the extension kit to make it longer this new one longer and it's gonna go right over top of the electrical plug right right there so we'll have to look at that and figure something out all right so ooh, those are sexy specs these are just safety glasses i got foam inserts good for riding and stuff like that so anyways um i didn't show you much but I got the new opener almost all the way up and installed. Uh, just figured the wife was home, so I didn't record. So I'm going to record now. But she's off to do some stuff again and get my tripod set up again. And I just got to mount up the other side and do some trimming on that eventually. Uh, on the brackets anyways and then finish getting everything put together and plug it in give it a try I think it should be a little while yet but I think it's just about that's 130 right now so we, yeah well I'm getting there I got that gave me the hardest time was figuring out how to mount it to the ceiling so after a little YouTube search I figured something out I'm not done with that I don't think I think I want to brace it up a little bit more but yeah, I got that part done. I just gotta wire everything up to the openers and I cut myself self short there, but it'll be done after I get everything wired up. But right now, I gotta go pick up the kids. The wife is at her, <clears throat> uh, she started a new job. So she's getting you know drug tested and all that stuff right now. So uh, she's running a little bit later than she thought she would be. So. I'm going to have to go pick the kids up. So, take a break. Cool down for a little bit. So, it got starting hot in the garage with the uh, doors open or with the door closed. Uh, I'll park the side by side, and close the house up <clears throat> because it's kind of raining a little bit. So, I'll be back in a little bit. been a little while now. I had to run the cables down to the sensors. This does have sensors. So the last one, but uh, I didn't know what cable sensors. Uh, to see if anything is in the way when you go to hit the closure. I had to run a wire over. So we have a closure on the inside now. The last garage opener did not have one. Um, I also bought a wireless thing. So we have an outdoor opener or outside opener. And then we have two push buttons for the vehicles also. So I think I am now ready to plug in. Something happened. What is that, sir? So there's a light right here. The flash blue and went red. If that's good or not. Oh, I got light over to the one on the wall. That's red. All right, so and the sensors are red, and I just kicked my foot in front of it, and it was turned or flashed. One's green, one's red. Interesting. All right. Now, I don't have the opener actually or attached to the garage yet. So let's. Let's 
that and see if these clippings work. Button with push. That's so quiet. It's not moving very fast. I'm and I put the string on the door. Let me do that real quick and be back with it. So so new with this. After some slight programming, we now have a functioning garage door opener. It is so quiet. It is now also 8 p.m. and I am freaking exhausted, so I'm not gonna be lifting tonight. But I got a good workout working on this all day and being up in the attic above the garage. So that's gonna be it. Workout tomorrow.